Hi guys and welcome back to my channel, thank you for coming back. So today we have a Topshop haul, um, I've done a little bit of shopping on there, um, I've got some basics as usual, I've got some evening wear, kind of like festive party wear, and um, yeah, some daytime wear. So I thought I would show you what I picked up, links and sizes will be down below as well, so make sure you head down there if you want to shop anything, and I think that's all I have to say, so let's get into it. Okay, so I'm going to start off with some boring bits, um, boring but very essential. So if you watched my autumn winter capsule wardrobe video, I mentioned these t-shirts, I had the white one. They are the Topshop premium t-shirts, so they're 50 pounds they just are so good they're such good t-shirts they're super flattering and the way they like sit on the body it's really really nice it's not like too, it's not like stiff material and it's not really slinky it's just like the perfect like skimming material <laughs> so I picked up a black one in the UK 6 I've already worn this and this dog hair all over it but literally they're so so handy they're great for under blazers great for under jackets even for um, layering under like jumpers and things but yeah they just look super super nice so got that one in the black and also picked up in this grey colour so again a UK 6 I picked up this grey one because I was actually looking for a like logo t-shirt in this kind of coloured grey for an outfit I'm going to show you but when I was looking at them, I was just like, Ugh, they all say like these bands on them and I have no idea who these bands are and I would just feel weird wearing like a Nirvana, is it Nirvana? Yeah, like Nirvana or like Kiss t-shirt when I have never heard their music before in my life. So I opted for the plain one, but I really like this colour and it adds something different to my usual wardrobe. So yeah, picked up them. I guess I'll stick with some basic stuff. So I picked up some joggies. I need to get the prices up. Hold on. So I picked up some joggies. These I already have in a few different colours. Let me get them out. They are just the most softest, gorgeous joggies ever. Like, they're such a basic thing. But honestly, when you find... I have two pairs of joggies I wear. I wear this style from Topshop. And I wear misguided um, petite ones. And literally both of them are amazing. So they're like this. This lovely kind of like light marl grey. Um, actually, I think they're called Ecru. I call it Ecru online. Is that right or is that material? No, it's the colour. <laughs> um, so they look like this, they're very slightly ribbed and they're just really, really skinny and tight to the leg. They have little cuffs and they have a really lovely waistband as well. Super flattering, super, super soft and they keep their shape which is super important. Like I hate it when you wear tight stuff and then like they go baggy on like the bum and the knees. But these keep their shape um, at least for a couple wears and they wash really well as well. So I picked up that colour. I got these in a UK 4. I would recommend sizing down in these um, because, well... I am normally UK4. I would say maybe go true to size or if you're in between sizes then I would size down. They were £19 and then I also picked up these ones which are the exact same but in this darker grey colour. So these ones I would probably wear, I would wear more like to the shops or running errands and that kind of thing. So yeah, picked up them. Again they have the little um, waistband and the tie and then they're just ribbed all the way down and then they have a little tight cuff at the bottom as well. I will say I pick these ones normally up in a petite range size 4 but the other ones weren't in petite and these ones were in petite so these ones do fit slightly better but I mean ever so slightly like the length isn't really different or anything so petite or normal um, but yeah this is also in a UK 4 and they were also at £19. But next I got this little jumper in an extra small and it was £29 so it's just a basic thin knit it has a very slight high neck kind of like what I'm wearing now so it doesn't roll it just sits high on the neck and it's really really lovely in soft material nice and um, fitted to the body and then it has this gorgeous like stud detailing all over it and yeah, I just really loved it. I obviously wear a lot of black knits, especially coming into autumn winter. My outfit tends to get outfits tend to get very, very, very dark and can look quite boring. So I thought this was quite a cute little addition to have. I've never actually owned a jumper like it or anything really similar. So yeah, I'm really enjoying it. The only thing I will say is when I put it on, I don't know what it is. It kind of just reminds me of like skiing. I don't know why. Because I've never had a ski outfit that looks like this. There's just something about it that when I put it on, I feel like I'm I kind of look like I'm going skiing. But it does look super cute on and it fits really well. And I thought putting this under like oversized blazers or fitted blazers or even like leather jackets and things like that would just look super cute. And you know it's layering season so when you have an outfit and you've layered up to keep warm and then you go have lunch or something and you take off all your layers, it's nice to have um, like a nice cute top like this underneath it which still keeps you really lovely and warm. So yeah, I've got that one. Okay, next I got a pair of jeans. These are Johnny jeans. They are in waist 25, length 30, which is my usual size in Topshop jeans. But these are coated. So kind of like, from a distance, kind of look like leather trousers, but they're obviously not leather. They're just kind of like a coated jean. I really, really love them. Also, they're super black when they're on. So when you pair it with a black outfit, it doesn't look too different. The only thing that looks different is the texture, which I really like. They are high-waisted, they don't have belt loops, which is so annoying because I love belt loops, but it's fine, that's normally like what journeys are. And yeah, they were £40, 
Um, these fit super well. I absolutely love journey jeans. I very rarely wear skinny jeans anymore. But when I do, it's always Topshop journey jeans. They just fit so well. Um, and these also, again, I've worn them a few times and they do stay super tight. Again, going along the same thing, I'm going to keep saying it, I wear a lot of black, so throughout the next couple of months I like to add in like different textures to my outfits to not make it look so boring and like one dimensional, it's a lot of hand movement going on. <laughs> okay, next, I'm going to show you a pair of shoes because I, these shoes need like a whole video for themselves, honestly. Okay, are you ready? Because I'm obsessed. So, they look like this. <laughs> How in insane are these shoes like i cannot deal with them i'm so in love they're these gorgeous little um strappy block heel heels covered in this gold kind of tone sparkle and i literally fell in love with them like i am not one for sparkle as you guys know like i hate sparkle i never wear sequins or anything like that but I just love these so, so much. They have a really nice square front. They have like barely their straps. And then the whole thing is just this gorgeous gold glittery goodness. <laughs> I just love them so much. So I got these in the UK three. I thought these would be perfect for um, like any festive events, any dinners, that kind of thing where I'm not outside too much because they'll be cold. Also, I think these paired against like leather, so quite like a heavy rough material will look so cool. Like, oh my God. I just love them. So these were £39, which again, I think is such a good price considering like oh, how amazing they are. The only thing I will say is I did take a picture in these the other day and where the sparkle is like where your toe sits, like that is rough. Like I think that I've not worn them long enough to know, but I reckon that's going to hurt quite a bit throughout the night <laughs> but I mean I don't care look at them and also this heel is great for parties and that kind of thing because it's super thick so it's going to be a lot more comfortable than a stiletto or something like that um yeah oh my god I'm so in love okay next I have I'm out of breath I just <laughs> ran down to open the door for the postman um okay next I have a midi skirt so I have a lot of midi skirts I wear them all the time and I saw this one and I just had to get it I thought it was so cute so it's black it has an elastic waistband and it's um kind of like in this crinkle material and it's tiered so it has three different tiers to the material or like the overhang I just thought it was so cute I thought it would look so so good dressed up but also it looks really really cool dressed down I'll put a picture on screen here of where I'm already wearing it but yeah I just really really loved it um, I got it in a UK 4 which is always my size in Topshop skirts I don't actually have anything like this in the wardrobe and you can see the material is just really lovely like it kind of just it flows really nicely like when you wear it. So I've already worn this dress down as you would have seen in a pair of boots and one of the premium t-shirts and then leather jacket. But I think for evening you can put on a top like I'm wearing now, um, maybe some sock boots and a blazer or like a nice little blouse. I think there's lots of different ways you can wear this and I also think it will work throughout the next season. So yeah, I really, really loved it and had to pick that one up. Next, I'll just show you what I'm wearing because it's also a little Topshop piece. So it's a plain black long sleeved um, jumper and it is kind of like mesh so I don't know if it's going to show up on camera <laughs> reality of YouTube I've got my joggies on I don't know if it's going to show up too well on camera but in the like light direct light you can it's kind of like it's mesh it's mesh material so it's ever so slightly see-through but I've got a black bra on now and I would wear this out day and night and not be stressed about looking too revealing so it's not see-through in a bad way it is just ever so slightly I don't think it's going to show up but yeah I really like it and it's also got a really nice like elastic in it so it's quite stretchy and it sits really lovely and tight to the body so pick that one up as it was a little basic I just realized I didn't tell you how much the skirt was. So the skirt was £35, the top was £10 and I got it in a UK 8. Okay, I'm butchering this on the hanger but you'll obviously see it in the cutaway and it's so, so gorgeous. So I got this little blazer and um, it's black, obviously it's double breasted and it has this really gorgeous like blush, mm, not blush, more like a kind of like champagne nude lining which I absolutely love and also the lining as with all Topshop blazers is in the arms let me show you so when you roll it you have the lining coming out which i just think adds so much to a blazer and then this also has a waist tie so i think it looks so nice it's got a little attached belt in the same material you just cinch your waist in and it gives you such a nice shape but like i literally think this is the most flattering blazer i've ever worn the belt is removable as well so you can obviously exchange it for another belt or take it completely off but yeah i just really really love this also really like the buttons if you can see that i always mention buttons because they're such a big thing for me i think they can bring an item from looking amazing to looking so cheap like that so yeah really nice buttons um this one was in a uk 8 it was 49 pounds okay and then i have one more thing to show you let me take 
the charger though. Well, two more things, but it's one outfit. So it's this blazer in this gorgeous khaki green, again with that lovely lining. This lining's a little bit more like dark and nude. It's coming up quite pink on camera, but it's very like nude in person and it's gorgeous. Yeah, I just really love the color of this. I wear a lot of black and I wear a lot of black blazers. So I thought adding a nice green one to my collection wouldn't do any harm. Um, yeah, and I just thought also this colour is really nice for this time of year. I picked this one up on an 8. Again, it's got really lovely buttons and it is double-breasted. Yeah, I really loved the colour of this lining with the jacket. I thought it looked really cute. So yeah, I picked this one up mostly for evening wear. I think you could definitely wear it to the office or I, have, I will wear it into like meetings in London and things like that with a pair of loafers. But I picked it up with like party season in mind. I did actually pair it with these shoes and it looked amazing. The blazer was £49 and the trousers were... 30 pounds and I got these in the UK for I'm not doing a very good job of showing you but they're just literally like I think they called them peg suit trousers online so just really nice tailored um not too tight and not too slim line but just good straight leg um tailored trousers and belt loops all the way around as well which I find super super handy um and yeah they're just really really gorgeous they sit really nicely on the leg they finish at the right length the only thing I would say is they're ever so slightly big on my waist so I would need to put either a little stitch in them or just put a belt on um, and yeah, I just really, really love the two of them together. I thought it was a really cute party season slash workwear slash daywear slash meeting outfit. These trousers also just felt really like premium. Um, if you can see in the lining, they have the same lining as the jacket. And I just, no one's going to see that. But I think just when you know it's there, it's just a nice, it's a nicely made piece, you know. It's a really nice two piece. So yeah, I really loved it. And as I say, paired with those um, sparkly shoes, it looked a dream. And I just put a little um, black racer vest underneath it. I actually will put a picture on screen here and show you how I styled it. Okay, so that is everything that I picked up from Topshop this time. Um, any links will be down below and sizes and all the information will be down there. So make sure to check that out. If you like this video, please make sure to give me a thumbs up and hit subscribe for me. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.